Well, Leslie, D.C. Police Chief Robert Conti says Commander Jason Bagshaw was the officer who shot and killed 23-year-old Lazarus Williams right here at the wharf on Saturday. A week later, almost a week later, Conti still stands by the actions of Bagshaw and Bagshaw's wife, who is also an MPD officer. Clearly, there was a threat that they saw. Chief Robert Conti said that after publicly releasing four videos of Saturday's wharf shooting, two body camera videos show responding officers telling off-duty commander Jason Bagshaw and his wife to get down shortly after the incident. Bagshaw's wife is actually on top of another man on the street. Give me a set of handcuffs. All the while, Lazarus Wilson's body lies just a few yards away. All right, all right, cuff him. The two other videos come from surveillance cameras. Conti said one showed Wilson drawing a gun. Who or what he is pointing it at is unclear. In another video, diners at Bistro du Jour are seen ducking under tables. Clearly, uh, they were startled uh, by something. Conti said Bagshaw and his wife were enjoying the night inside that restaurant before the shooting. He said Bagshaw hasn't given MPD an official statement yet, which is not abnormal at this point in an investigation. The chief added officers did not check Bagshaw Bagshaw's blood alcohol level either at the scene. It wouldn't ordinarily be a requirement unless there were signs of impairment or something like that. As for whether more video of the incident exists. There may be some, you know, person with a cell phone video that may come up. You know, we may, you know, find, oh, well, this person had a camera on their boat and then that is revealed. But right now we've released the video that we have. Now, Wilson's family told us yesterday that they do believe that there are more cameras here around the wharf that could possibly have more footage to provide a fuller view of that shooting and everything that led up to it. And you can see there are many cameras here. There's one right there next to the Bistro du Jour. There's another one right there at another building here on the wharf as well. Now, the Civil Rights Group Harriet's Dream also believes the people inside the restaurant got under the table in response to Bagshaw's actions not Wilson's. Now, one more thing. You may have noticed or heard an officer there saying cuff him. We asked the police chief as to why Wilson was cuffed while he was on the ground with his injury. And Chief Conti told us that sometimes officers will do that in use of force cases out of an abundance of caution. With the very latest from the wharf, John Henry W, USA 9. Yeah, clearly more to come on this, John. Thank you.